Hello again and welcome to Off Grid Living with Lindsay. Today what we're going to be doing is um, showing you how we can slow cook things on a tiny on our tiny stove, slow cooking on a tiny stove. Um, and I'm going to be doing an FEB. And for those of you not from Ogwell, that's a faux English breakfast. Okay. Okay, first up in this one, we got sourdough croutons, but these have been massaged, I think is the word I would use, with um, slow roasted tomatoes. We got the tomatoes, Jill got the tomatoes from her polytunnel, and we slow roasted them on top of the stove, and we just massaged that end of the sourdough croutons and crisped them all up. Beautiful job, lovely job, man. Next dish here, we've got potatoes, again, Jill dug the potatoes from the garden. Uh, we got chipolatas and we got smoked bacon. And we've kind of cooked all of these ones separately and given them a slow, nice slow cook, nice slow bake. And then sort of brought it all together, mixed it all up and you've got a beautiful version. It's really a, a soft grid living of, a, of a, a version of a, a filling wrist breakfast here. Sausages, uh, potatoes and, and smoked bacon, beautiful job. Uh, and then finally on this one, we got mushrooms. Okay, we picked the mushrooms obviously and roasted them slowly on the small stove. And there you go, the whole thing. Hi there everybody and welcome to Off Grid Living. And today we're gonna do a surprise full English breakfast. So we're gonna go up and invite everybody to come down to the Goatarium, which is the other name we use for our off grid shed, which stems back to the fact we built this for goats, but we never actually put any in. Uh, we're going to get them down, we're going to go and film their reaction to being invited and then film their reaction when they come in and discover that we've sort of created a little off-grid breakfast bar and we're going to do a couple of dishes and uh, a nice Bucks Fizz uh, and see what they say. Hopefully they'll like it. Okay, so let's go and uh, invite the first few over. Right, let's go and see if we can find Jill and Sonia who work in the caravan office. Uh, and then we'll go and try and find all the young ones, Gracie and Rosie, and their two lads, Alex and Giles. Uh, and then we'll go and find Lindsay and spring the surprise on him. Okay, so off we go. So I, I suppose in a way this is like a little tour of Salamander Stokes. So let's see if we can find Sonia and Jill in the office. Hello. 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 Alright. Oh my goodness. In about in about sort of ten, fifteen minutes, can you two come down to the Cotarium? Okay. Got a little breakfast surprise for you. Alright, that's in a minute. Thank you. Okay, so we'll pop up to the house, which is just near to where everything is, you know, Salamander Central. Uh, and we'll ask all the young ones to come down for breakfast too in about twenty minutes, twenty five minutes. We got like ten minutes yeah, yeah. in twenty minutes to come down to the Goterium. Yeah. All of you together. Okay, so that's the main protagonist invited. All you got to do is ask Lindsay at the end, just for a bit of fun, and he can tell you what he's doing next week. Uh, so we'll get back down there and uh, open the off-grid breakfast at bistro. So we've got to wait a little bit of time for the, the stuff on the stove to heat up a little bit more. So we'll just have a quick drink. Way! Hi, it's Cam. Right, so who really likes that? Right, so just a tiny little bit of this. Well, cheers. Well, cheers. This is like well, unexpected. Yeah. <laughs> unexpected um, cheers. Cheers. Thank you. breakfast. Cheers. Right, I'll see how old it is. That's nice. Oh, that's lovely. Very good. Mm. Hey, this is really fun. Is there a fault? Yes, there is. Sorry. Right. <laughs> yeah. So. I like the bench. That's fine. I'll try it. That was quite strong, mate. <laughs> we'll just put a splash in there. So. Uh, 
Right, so on the comfy chairs. Right, so we've got like a full English breakfast, and I don't know. Which might be too good. Mm -hmm. Just cheese, they all cook for hours at the Alright, have a good time. <laughs> Right, well there we are. Thanks for watching uh, Off Grid Living with Lindsay. Next time we're going to be doing logs with Lindsay. And we're also going to be looking at axes. And um, we're going to have a little look at uh, toasting forks as well. Okay, so I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.